Hey guys, what's up? It's Bronson 75 here and welcome back to my channel. So today I am showcasing gameplay of Sonic Dash. Although I've already I've already showcased gameplay of this game back in 2016, three years ago. And you know, that was back when I was I was using a standard camera to record. Um, you know, when I was playing this on my tablets, you know, that was when that was also when I was I was not aware that screen recorders were a thing. But yes, the reason I am doing this is because this game actually received a big update. I think around last year, and yes, one of the one of the new thing one of the new things about the about this update is this, to where like instead of a map, like instead of uh, a map where like you have to cross like a di um a certain distance just to unlock some stuff like new characters and, and like new characters and everything, um you still have this where you have to use um you see the the little gems on the top right hand corner of the screen to actually build stuff for these flickers right here, and I I gotta say this um this looks pretty cool. Like we have all these flickies, like um, you know, with on the slide and the ship and everything, so that looks pretty cool. And not only that, um, uh, this game actually had, um, this game actually features new stages here. So, so yes, um, so it's got the beach zone, of course. Um, I love, um, I'm loving uh, the build build ups right here. And um, yes, yeah, so and we got a new stage here, which is the the snow mountain zone. And honestly, this is actually my fa um my favorite one, my favorite built one, because because there's actually um, uh, the Sonic One title screen image. Uh, where that um that small seal is playing on, and then and then another one is where he appears to be selling stuff or something. I don't know, but that looks pretty amazing. Um, yeah, we, and we of course we also have Green Hill Zone, pretty basic stuff there. We also have the Temple Zone, uh, which I do have to collect certain animals to unlock. We also have Sky Sanctuary Zone, one of the new stages added to this game. So I, I'm it's actually kind of surprising how um. That they uh, that they actually brought it into this game, just like with Forces Speed Battle. All right, and then last but not least, yes, we have Mushroom Hill Zone, another new stage added here. So that's actually pretty amazing. So yes, and yeah, just to make just uh, my biggest problem with this new update is that you have to collect like a bunch of flickies in order to um in order to uh, get new stuff built here. So right now here, um, so I need like um yeah, I need like eighty. A, any more of um of that animal to unlock the next part right here and uh, 50 more for that one so yeah it takes forever but but in all seriousness i really do love this update it looks pretty dang amazing all right so all right so i'm just gonna show you all my character roster so so we have sonic of course we have knuckles here we have amy tails shadow cream blaze silver espio classic sonic roots the bats and we, and I surprisingly still have my Angry Birds characters, uh, which is pretty amazing because I only have two of them. I remember there's like a third one. I think his name was Chuck from, I think uh, when this game had a crossover with um with the Angry, Angry Birds Epic game. So yeah, that's kind of surprising. I, I, and I also have Andronic and the two latest characters that I just recently got, who are Santa Big and Elf Classic Sonic. I think I might showcase them in the next video because you know this is my second time um. No, third time trying to record this video, by the way. So I wanted to showcase them, but I, I'm just gonna showcase them for the next video because, yeah, because you know, cause seeing as how like it's like it's I'm recording this after Christmas, so so yeah. So just want to say Merry Christmas to you guys. Hope you hope, I just hope you all have a have a merry very merry Christmas. Just had an awesome Christmas party yesterday. It was freaking amazing. So I hope you guys did too. So yeah. Um. Anyway, so back on topic right now. All right, so we have some brand new characters here. We have Charmy right here, who you can get by unlocking Snow Mountain, even though I've already completed the entirety of that stage. I should have unlocked them, but for some reason, the game just says I didn't for some reason. I don't know. Well, I'm hoping there's like well, another way to work this around it um, after, after I unlock everyone else. We also have Vector right here, where you, who you can get by completing the Temple Zone. We also got Jet here, who you can get by completing Mushroom Hill. And we have big as and we, and we have a uh, regular big as well as metal sonic who are in app purchases for th th for uh, three dollars so yeah hopefully some at some point i might um grab myself a google play card to get them all right and all right so, so this game still has some missions here so all right so this is the mission that i'm about to complete right here with just a few hundred enemies still got the prize wheel prize wheel and the jigsaw uh the jigs what is it the jigsaw concept um not concept, uh, set piece right here. So yeah, so right now I'm on price four, so that's that's where we can get five red rings. So anyway, let, without further ado, let's finally get into the gameplay. Man, I talk so much sometimes. <laughs> Alright, now let's get up. I don't know, let's start with the head start right here. Alright, 
All right, so besides, uh, so yeah, even though this game I got a massive update, like uh, a lot of like um, new, a lot of uh, various changes um, have been made to the to the main menu. Yeah, the gameplay hasn't really changed much. Only, um, only except that there's a yeah, there's like a uh, brand new stages that you can go to. So that's pretty, pretty amazing. It's kind of crazy how this game, like this game came out like six years ago, yet it's still getting, yet it's still getting these new updates. It's kind of like Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle, where they, where they're always like adding new events, new characters, new summoning banners, and all that stuff. Like I swear, they never like stop introducing, new, like they're they're never gonna stop updating the game. In like, it's kind of interesting. It is interesting how like they're, I think they're doing that probably because like they're just to um, introduce newcomers. So yeah, it's pretty crazy how these these older games are still getting updated. Um. Still getting updated all this time, so it's pretty crazy. Alrighty, so it looks like we're gonna be heading into Snow Mountain Zone, and one interesting thing about this um <clears throat> about this plays is that it actually plays a, a remixed version of Diamond Dust from Sonic 3D Blast, so that's actually pretty pretty cool. Yeah, because surprisingly, it's not the one from Sonic Generations, but I think it's just like. Like I think it's like a just like a brand new uh, remix that was made for this. So this actually sounds pretty cool. Like I love the guitar riffs and everything, the beats and all that stuff. Like oh my god, this sounds so good. Mm -hmm. My god, listen to that. It's so freaking awesome. All right, boost right here. All right, and now it looks like we're about to fight Eggman. This is this is crazy though. The past few times I've been playing this game, especially when I was um. When I was trying to collect enough tokens to unlock Elf, Classic Sonic, and Santa Big, yeah, neither, neither, um, neither Eggman or Zash show up. So yeah, it's re it's really weird, but, but hey, it, it, at least uh, it's a good thing though. At least, at least since I'm recording. All right, so here's Doctor Eggface right here. Alrighty. I don't even remember uh, if I mentioned uh, uh, back in my um, original gameplay of. Um, Original gameplay. Back when I showed when I showed uh, gameplay of this the first time three years ago, I don't remember if I mentioned that this song um, is actually ripped. I don't remember if I said this is um this is this is a song ripped from Sonic Adventure when you fight um, the Egg Hornet. So yeah, yeah, it's pretty cool though. Pretty interesting. All right, so what you do right here, you just have to dodge his attacks and everything. You like he shoots missiles at you at first, and then you just tries to like uh, throw these mines at you. So yeah, just dodge him as always. All right. All right. So, all right. So it's so yeah. These the way you attack these boss fights. Boss fights is different. So you actually have to tap at the right time in order to um in order to damage them because yeah because if you actually miss time your taps then yeah you end you end up losing and then you know he just gets away. And just like that, Eggman has been defeated. Hex <laughs> yeah. God, this remix is so good. Okay, we're just gonna grab the red ring and yeah, and we're gonna stop right here because yeah, I think I think I'm probably gonna showcase um showcase tails next. So yeah, there we go. With that, we have um we've completed the jigsaw puzzle and we have been given five red star rings. Pretty amazing. All right, so each time uh, each time you finish uh, these rings, you um, you collect the uh, you collect the. Um, Many animals by defeating certain um, defeating uh, certain bad things. So all right, so we got four of those right there, and our build is available. Awesome. All right, nice and oh okay. So that mission right there, we need to like use uh, three boosters. Yes, and even in um and every time you complete these missions, you can actually get you can actually uh, earn some gems uh, in order to um in order to um, build us uh, some new stuff. <clears throat> okay. Alrighty, so that was Sonic right there. So the next character we're gonna showcase here is my boy Tails. Alright, and we're just gonna upgrade his dash boost. And I think a shield too. Alrighty, let's do this. And we're gonna do this in the beach zone. Oh wait, 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 wait. Okay, I forgot to uh, equip the boosters first. Uh okay. We're gonna cool dash dash. Okay, just let's just do this. All right, there, there we go. All right, so we're playing as Tails right here. So yeah, 
Yeah, literally every character, every character in this game play exactly the same. Like, there's no, like, real differences. There's no, like, real differences whatsoever. So, yeah. At least, uh, Sonic Dash 2, Sonic Boom kind of, um, kind of fixed that. Like, at least somewhat, because, like, I believe, like, uh, I remember, from what I remember in that game, I think characters have, like, uh, some, some of their own abilities. Like, I think, like, uh, <clears throat> like, whenever Tails dies, like, he never, like, he, like, he gets a, he gets a re uh, a free revive. And, and I think Knuckles' uh, ability in that game is that he does a ground pound, like, when he spin dashes. Uh, I remember um, Amy having, like, a, a dash mask where whenever she dashes, whenever, like, she smashes stuff, she she earns rings. So, that's pretty amazing. I have not actually played that game since the last video I, I've done on it. Like, even though I actually, like, uh, revisited it one day and, the, and the, like, like, one day I did, like, there was no, there was nothing new, pretty much. Like, there was, like, still the same stuff, there was still the same events, like, no, nothing new. So, it's, it's just re really weird. Alright, I'll get into my name later. So, we're now on Mushroom Hill Zone, and I think this is the, I think this is the same, so the same song that played in Sonic Generations. I believe, like, Sonic Generations 3DS, like, in Act 2, when you play as Modern Sonic. So, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. Alright, but OS6, we're now back in Seaside Hill now. Man. So I didn't notice it. I didn't notice that Sonic Forces has um forces just featured um a new character who is a uh, who is a uh, Xena um from um Sonic Lost World you know as a part of the Deadly Six. I'm surprised like I'm actually surprised they decided to add her of all. I'm actually surprised she got added into into the game. But of course we had like Zap we had the uh, Zabok in it. There's um. Uh, Oh wow, and of course there there here is a Zaz right here who we're about to fight fight right now. Yeah, we have Zabog, we had Zaz in that game, and now we have Zeta. Yeah, I wonder are they gonna add like uh, Master Zik next or Zor or Zomom? Like I, I seriously wonder. But this is crazy. We're wow, we're actually fighting both Eggman and Zaz in the same video. Wow. That's actually pretty convenient, I must say. Alright, Zaz, you're going down, dude. Yeah, I will say that I think uh, him and Zabok are probably my favorites of the Deadly Six. Um, I don't, I never really care for like er everyone else, to be honest. I mean, I think uh, Master Zix seemed pretty interesting, and Zoma was kind of funny at times. And you know, Xena was just pretty girly, and you know, Zori, he's pretty much, pretty much emo. You know, I, I kind of agree with what everyone says about him. All right, for this boss right here, he pretty much does the same. He pretty much does the same pattern as Eggman does, like he shoots a bunch of stars at you. I think I remember at Sonic Lost World, like uh, he he was also using uh, this um yeah this yellow ball right here to attack you or something. I don't remember. It's been a while since I played that game. Well, the 3DS version, I mean. There we go. Keep tapping at the right time. Bam. Man, I said I think that boss fight from Sonic Lost World is actually pretty fitting fitting for this one. So there we go. There we go. Oh wow, I did not even realize we're at, we're at like a, a million meters already. Dang, that's crazy. <laughs> okay, I guess we're gonna play more of this and then pretty much end it off here. I don't think we even went through Sky Sanctuary Zone, did we? Okay, no, we didn't. Just realized. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, at least we got that red star ring. Okay, thank God. All right, but we're just gonna end it off here right uh, right away. I don't even I don't even know how it still still hit that right there. Right. Okay, and of course we got another build available. Okay, yes, I enjoy playing Sonic Dash, and I, I've already rated you. But if you do press uh, if you do press yeah on that, then like you go to like to the Google Play Store section where Sonic Dash is, then you just come back and then it just gives you a red star ring anyway. That's kind of that's kind of um that's kind of really hilarious. All right, there we go. So we collected enough for. Okay, so we have 300 of those. We have like 370 of those. Okay. Okay, is there anything that like costs less? No? Yeah, okay. Alright, I guess I have to spend, uh, um, I guess I have to spend 150 of these. Great. Alright, let's freaking do it. Okay, at least that one cost us whatevs. Alright, and I guess before we end this, let's see where we're gonna get. 
can we get like the 50 gems one? Okay, I guess not. Since that we're gonna get Alright, um 750 rings. Alright, I'm okay with that. Alright, so anyway guys, uh so yep, that is it for the first part of the gameplay of Sonic Dash. So if y'all enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel and make sure to hit that little bell down there so that way you can get notified for every video I upload. And yeah, so next part of this game the next part of this gameplay will be um yeah, I will be showcasing these two guys right here. Yes, I, pro I probably should have started show showcasing gameplay of this game much sooner. So, and especially since it's at, um, especially since it's after Christmas. So, so yeah, definitely going to be showcasing these guys. So, yeah, yeah. I think my next, I'm thinking about doing a video game collection video, like a massive haul of them. Yeah, that might be my next video. Yeah, I might do that. So yeah, so yeah. Anyway, hope you all are having a, I hope you all are having an awesome Christmas break, and I, and I will see you guys in my next video. So peace out and take care.